There's a clown right here. But, but I, don't, I can't get off the mic. Man. That's the rule number one. I'll give rule number one. Give me the gun. I gotta hold on to the mic. Right. This is James Tom reporting for this goddamn station, whatever it is. I'm out of here. No, wait, wait. I don't agree with you because okay. you never talk about my name. All I was talking what about you for two, two years when you were injured. Yeah. People used to say to me, UFC, why do you keep having Khabib on your show? UFC, He's not fighting. And UFC, I would have you on it again UFC and again. Never send yes. two agreements for the fight. For I the hope fight. you realize that they didn't do right by you. I don't understand. Because you play game. Because no, this I play the game. Yes, I'm the one who plays the game. Because you play game. Okay. I'm the one who played the game. Okay. You have to stop. Okay. You have to stop. Stay loyal. Okay. Are you going to fight the winner of huh? Conor Eddie? Are you going to fight the winner? I want to fight with you. Ah, oh, come on. This you. is big. I wanna, this is, big. This I, I is showing fight. the world that Jews and Muslims I, can hey, come hey, together hey. as friends, right? Okay. Salam alaikum. Well, Peace in the Middle East, right? right? Ariel Helwani post-fight at UFC 135 alongside Quinton Rampage Jackson, who lost via submission tonight to John Jones. And wait, wait, hold on. Why you had to bring it up the way I, I lost tonight? You could have just said, fault John Jones. Why you had to just bring it up the way I lost? Well, via it is a fact, right? I'm just trying to state the facts in case someone didn't see the pay-per-view. Oh, okay. I'm sorry for rubbing it in. Yeah, it seemed like you was rubbing it in. You know, Something against me? Do you not like me, Nick? I, I feel like you instigate fights quite a bit, but, uh, you know, that's... Fights between the fighters? Yeah, I mean, maybe that's your, that's your job, but where I come from, you know, people like that get slapped. You said all the right things, but I'd have to imagine after all the promotion, the commercials, the world tour, all that, there, there's a part of you that would be disappointed if it's not Jose. I mean, this is a culminate. You want to beat the king, right? The, the current king. The current king. You're looking at the current king, Ariel. You're interviewing the current king. Elster, he told us uh, that he saw you yesterday. Why are you standing so far away? How are you? I got scared, man. I'm talking with the lady oh. and all of a sudden... But, Sorry, but, I don't come, mean to butt in. It's a scrum sort of format. In. You have your way of forcing your... your no, that's not very nice. Anyway, you look great. I like the jacket. On your I can hear you. Left. On your left? Ariel Hawani. Oh, s***. <laughs> the hell you won't... <coughs> well, congratulations on the win, first and foremost. Uh, uh, that, that means a lot coming from you. Thank you. <laughs> uh, question for Nick, right over here. Uh, to your left, right. Can I ask you why you weren't here yesterday and what happened and whose fault was it? <laughs> there you go. Th th thanks, Dana. I know you, man. Appreciate it. That was actually my question. That's it. What, right, what happened uh, yesterday? Was it because of... Uh, you Ariel, know, the, yeah. he's here. Okay, I'm just, he's just, here. He's there now. All right. You got any questions about the fight? Obviously, it was a big story. Yeah, we, he's we here. spoke about it. He's it's, here now. It's a part of the story. I understand. And, and Which part the, of what story? Of this fight. A lot of people are interested in watching this press conference to see if Nick was going to show up because he wasn't there yesterday. So we would He's here to today, go and I guarantee you he'll great. be there tomorrow at the weigh-ins, and I guarantee you he will be there Saturday. The outcome of your fight, I said, Rampage, that's my lock of the night. That means you lost money on me. No, that means I picked you, oh, okay. despite the fact that you called me out and, and made me a little nervous on camera. Well, you, well, you've been talking bad about me, homie. I get tired of that. People don't know how much work I put in to this job, and they disrespect fighters and think they can say whatever they want to say about us, man. We human beings, dog. Ariel Hall.